Well, good morning, Western Slope. I'm your meteorologist, Baird Vincent, taking a look at that live tower cam. We have a beautiful sunrise this morning. We have above average temperatures expected to continue with a chance for showers this afternoon and overall a windy day ahead of us, folks. We are starting off at 70 degrees with a not much going on with that wind. However, we're going to be increasing quite rapidly in temperature as we go through these morning hours, getting into the 90s even before noon and then warming up to triple digits from there for the highs today. Winds though pretty mild starting out today, but they're expected to increase as we increase in temperature today as well. For those highs right above average for this time of year with potential to break some records. We broke records earlier this week on Monday. We got up to 107 in Grand Junction. So before that pollen outlook though, grass is going to be the only culprit for your allergies as that growing season slowed down. Everything's starting to kind of kick back for that pollen. As far as those temperatures, though, you can thank this high pressure system. We got this upper level high pressure system bringing in a lot of that warmer air to our region. And as far as that radar's looking pretty clear this morning, however, that'll change this afternoon, though, as you get into the afternoon hours, we have potential for some clouds. We did see some cloud coverage yesterday. That's going to go ahead and tell us that we do have some moisture to tap in for some showers. Most of those showers will be north of that I-70 corridor, though, for today. You can expect them between noon and then 4 p.m. And then that'll pretty much continue with very low chances of showers up until tonight. But we'll have some cloud coverage as well. So definitely uh, be prepared for maybe some showers, especially if you're up in these northern counties, Rifle, Meeker, Rangeley area. If we're in the valley, we don't have to, much to expect. We're still super dry in those lower levels, so that rain will evaporate before it reaches the surface, leaving us with some gusty outflow winds. And as far as those highs for today, folks, we got triple digits in Grand Junction, Moab. We're getting really close in Delta and the 90s really everywhere else. We got 80s in Aspen and Gunnison, though, for the upward elevations. And then as far as for tonight, though, we're going to get down into the 60s for a little bit of a break from that heat, folks. And then tomorrow we're going to be warming up to similar temperatures that we are going to experience for today. we got triple digits in Grand Junction and Moab, 90s everywhere else. They're going to hit it really close in Delta for tomorrow again. And then for that extended day, folks, we have triple digits all week this week. Uh, we have some clear skies after tomorrow and then Montrose looking just slightly cooler remaining in the 90s. But we'll go back and talk about those showers for today. If you're in the upper elevations, you're not going to have that dry air close to the surface. So uh, if you're in an upper elevation area, definitely pay attention. You could see some showers for today. Now, as far as temperatures, though, we are very hot. So definitely stay hydrated. Grab that sunscreen if you're headed out the door and just be ready to warm up to some really warm temperatures today.